As for what's going to happen tonight, not much. We've got a few light showers moving in over the Bay Area. The high def Doppler is uh, showing the strongest cells at the moment, but this will change. Senator over Santa Rosa, which at the top of the hour is reporting light rain, and as you can see, that has changed. They're getting moderate rainfall, but even in Santa Rosa, just two tenths of an inch by the time all is said and done. Uh, as we have a look at the Bay, looking nice tonight, so is the city. Isn't that pretty? Concord right now has 54 degrees in San Francisco. It's 51 in Santa Rosa with rain, 51 degrees right now. That rain will sink south and the surf is up too. High surf advisory is posted until 3 in the morning on Friday, triggered by those big northwesterly swells. Futurecast shows this rain will be out of here. It's a convenient rain. It starts tonight. It'll fall overnight. There's not much anyway. And by the time it gets down to San Jose, as you'll see in a moment, there's not much left. The next chance is coming in by Friday. Another week system, another nighttime system that'll come in Friday night, linger a little bit through Saturday morning, just like tonight's rain is going to linger till just before sunrise. You see on the future cast, it all breaks apart as it moves south over the Bay Area. And by 9 o'clock tomorrow morning, there could be some patchy fog around, but that's it. We'll go to severely clear and get a nice sunny day out of the last day of 2020. And the first day of 2021 looks pretty good as well as we begin the new decade. Decades begin in years ending in one, if you've forgotten that. So the uh, first decade, the first day of the new decade uh, will begin sunny and dry in the Bay Area. In terms of how much we get from this little cold front, 11 hundredths of an inch in Santa Rosa, and then by the time we get down to uh, San Jose, it's just a hundredth of an inch, so again, not a lot. In terms of chances, Santa Rosa looks like a pretty good certainty for Monday when another significant system comes in, but each day there's little bumps up in the chances of a little bit of rain falling in Santa Rosa. By the time we get to San Jose, look at that, the numbers are way down. So these systems are all coming out of the north and having the breath knocked out of them by the time they get down into the South Bay. But again, for Monday, San Jose looks like pretty good chances. It all turns to snow in the mountains. It's uh, Donner Pass, almost five inches of snow, not a lot. But nevertheless, a little bit may someday lead to a lot. Light rain tonight in the Bay Area, Bay-wide. Dry for tomorrow. It'll be a nice day, nice sunny day for New Year's Eve and a chilly night tomorrow night. Rain chances improve this weekend. It'll be wetter on Monday. Overnight lows tonight. Santa Rosa is down to 39. Fremont 44. Daytime highs for tomorrow with sunny skies. For New Year's Eve, Sunnyvale comes in at 57, Morgan Hill 58 degrees. Over in the East Bay, we'll see Concord at 60. In Walnut Creek 59, Brentwood 58 degrees, and in Livermore 57. Up in the North Bay, rain tonight, sunshine tomorrow, 61 degrees at Ronan Park, 62 at Novato, and 60 at Kenfield. And then uh, Ukiah will hit 56 degrees. For New Year's Eve, around midnight, the numbers will be in the mid-40s. And in the extended forecast, we're going to be looking for things to be partly sunny for Thursday. And then a little bit of rain, a possibility Friday night, Saturday a few showers, Sunday a few showers. Better rainmaker coming in on Monday.